Blue and gold banquet. Yes, it's held as a blue and gold banquet. So he for Boy Scouts. So he's gonna cross the bridge to become to become what? Boy Scouts. So it's a special day. So make sure to congratulate Holden. We'll update you soon. <laughs> How's your food? It's very chicken. <laughs> so you has got chicken, chips. What else? Grapes? I'm not eating Lemonade. Some other stuff. Has not begun yet. We've got Scouting Adventure, and we've got Outdoor Adventure, and we've also got Duty to God. So we've got those completed, and I believe you also had your Silver Creek Roundup. You've got a passion there for Silver Creek Roundup as well, so we're going to do your AOL here in just a second. So there are those. Congratulations. Chad was also busy. He's got Protect Yourself Rules, Outdoor Adventure, and Building a Better World. And then also, uh, Chad, although he also earned his AOL today, he actually got his Bob Dad as well. So um, no matter where you start at in scouting, whether you start off uh, young or you start off in wolves, bears, weeblows, wherever, uh, one of the first things you will do is go back and finish your bobcat. So uh, a lot of times you won't go back and necessarily finish everything, but uh, you, everybody goes back and they finish their bobcat. The bobcat is simply, um, for those that haven't done it, that might be a little bit younger, like our lion, um, it's just the basic things and basic principles and rules and motto and fundamentals of scouting that you earn. So you always go back and do that. So congratulations, Chad. And then Jonah. Jonah's got a couple things here. We actually got two bags for Jonah here. So, duty to God, you complete it. Stronger, faster, higher. And protect yourself. And then in the other one, we have. Outdoor Adventure, Building a Better World, and Duty to God. So we've got all these here, plus on top of that, Jonah, you managed to earn your Weeblo as well and finish that up. So we had uh, a couple boys join our pack this year from Pack 85. Um, they were having some other. Uh, their pack kind of folded and went under, so they came to us here and they managed to finish up a bunch of things here. Jonah was one of those that finished up quite a bit and also earned his Weeblo. And although he didn't get his Arrow of Light today, he's going to finish that up. He is super close. So he did get his Weeblo, a bunch of awards, and he's on his way. We're going to call him back up here just a minute so that way he can cross over back to Troop 85. Congratulations, John. Okay. 
three. So they were working with St. Clair. And hold in. Hold in. A couple different things for hold in here. Um, hold in earns protect yourself, scouting adventure, outdoor adventure, and building a better world. So I'm going to give you those. Congratulations. Tell you what, guys, you got those on board. Why don't you go run those back to your parents real quick and meet me back up here? Let's see. Oh, super close. I guess I was going to make an announcement last week after Scout Sunday Mass. There were some guys that earned their religious tools in Taylor. Um, and then the Parley Day, which is for the older boys. And Blaze also earned several other awards through religious book um, listening to So well, if you have any questions about any of those, you can Dan, the expert on it, he'll be happy to answer your questions. And for those of you that didn't do them this year, that's something you can work towards next year. So there are two different awards as, as you progress in the scouting. Um, our treasurer, Pat, wants Six in our AOL Den this year. Um, again, two of those boys that came to the Den, you're going to see them here in just a minute. Uh, they came from Pack 85, and they're going to be crossing over to Troop 85 in a minute. Um, but the four of these boys, I have known for quite a lot of them, I've known since we've been in Lions together and all the way through. And some, like Chad, maybe came a little bit later in his scouting career, but uh, still young enough to uh, move on over to Boy Scouts. So, uh, everybody that's here, we're gathered here to acknowledge and honor these who have earned the arrow of life. Uh, for those that don't know, uh, I'm Mike Motive, but as Greg said, I've been here for about five years, but I don't know a lot of the newer faces that we've seen this year. Uh, I had the pleasure of being a den leader and a cup master for several years. So the four boys you see in front of you have satisfied the requirements for the highest ranking cup scouting, the arrow of life. I'm humbled to have had the opportunity to watch each of you grow and transition from Bobcat to Tiger, Wolf, Bear, and on to Weedlows, and now over on to Boy Scouts. Um, the Arrow Light is a ward that is represented by the Indian sign for the sun over the arrow. The sun shines from the arrow with seven rays to light your trail, one for each day of the week. These seven rays stand for the seven great virtues of life. Wisdom, courage, self-control, justice, faith, hope, and love. Virtues that a Weeblo Scout must have if they're going to succeed in advance in scouting and in life. For younger scouts, living by these and using these seven great virtues will help you achieve much on your trail upward to the arrow of life. A scout has wisdom. Having wisdom doesn't mean a scout is smarter than others. It means that he uses what he knows to live a better life, to be a good example for other people, young and old, scouts and others, family and friends. A scout has courage. Having courage doesn't mean that you're never afraid. Very courageous people are often afraid. However, facing danger despite your fear is the act of a brave, courageous scout. A scout has self-control. Scouts know when to stop. When you can stop yourself when you've had enough or done enough of something, eating enough, playing enough, or even working enough, then you have self-control. Know what behavior is correct in each situation and do it. When you have self-control, you are growing up as a scout. A scout gives justice. Justice is part of the Pledge of Allegiance, with liberty and justice for all. Justice is being fair with others and what when we go to school, work, and play with others. Justice means it doesn't matter who the person is, what color they are, or what they do, scouts are fair to everyone. A scout has faith. <coughs> scouts believe in God. Faith means that we believe in God and other things we cannot see. When you know God exists in your heart, you have faith. A scout has hope. Hope means you look forward to good things that you believe will happen. You know for better things tomorrow, but you work hard for today to make those good things happen. A scout has love. Scouts have many kinds of love. Love of family, love of home, and love of your fellow scouts. God and country are all part of scouting. Every kind of love is important for a full and happy life. 
At this time, I'd like to invite each of the Arrow Light parents to come forward and stand behind their Weeblo Scout. Oh no. You have to record and take pictures. The Arrow Light is recognized as a significant yeah. achievement by the Boy Scouts of America. As long as you are in scouting, even as an adult, you will be able to wear the symbol of the Arrow Light. It's in the corner for nine minutes. That's as a crazy. Boy Scout, you continue to wear the Arrow Light on your uniform as an adult leader. You wear a square knot representing the air of light on your uniform. So we're not going to pin these on, but I'm going to give them to your parents to let them present you with the award. <coughs> Congratulations oh, to these no. four boys for everything they've accomplished in the last couple of years. Um, like I said, I've known most of you. Well, Hulu came back to us. He started off in line with me way, way back a long time ago, along with Sean and Henry here. And Jeff started a couple of years ago here, so it's been a true pleasure. And uh, oh, well, I'm very proud of you here. And looking forward to you guys crossing over into the Boy Scouts here. So uh, congratulations to each one. stood upon the very same spot you stand today. I began it as a tiger cub, completed my arrow flight, crossed over the bridge and into Boy Scouts, eventually earning my Eagle Scout. Your parents have been by your side and will continue to guide you along this journey. The journey will become difficult and you'll have to take on more responsibility, but at no point will you be alone. Scouting is a brother. There will be points at times which you would like to give up, but you always have to remember nothing worthwhile is ever easy in life. With the support of your parents, friends, and leaders, along with your perseverance and determination, you will move forward. Only about 5% of Boy Scouts obtain the rank of Eagle Scout. I ask each one of you today to take on this journey into Boy Scouts and strive to reach your potential. The world needs more Eagle Scouts. So congratulations to each one of you for your achievements. And I wish each of you the best moving forward and challenge each of you to be one of those things for So, congratulations. <laughs> Craig? Yeah. Uh, to help you move forward on your journey in scouting, we have a gift that we would like to present to each one of you that Craig will present. said, I would invite forward the representatives from Troop 94.
Today, scouts from Pack 94 will begin a new journey on a new trail. We call this trail the Trail of the Eagle. As a member of Scouts VSA, you will take on many new challenges. We know that you have come a long way already. The Trail to Eagle will only become more challenging. You will experience many adventures and challenges along the trail. You will discover that the best part will be, the best part will be that you will share this journey hand in hand, not just with your friends or the fellow scouts in the troop, but also with your family and the entire community. Trail markers are used on all good trails to help you along the way. You have already learned about some important trail markers in scouting, the 12 points of the scout law. On the trail to Eagle, you will need to be trustworthy, just as for every bridge you cross, placing your trust in the builders and designers who made it. Your fellow scouts will need to be able to trust you. Trust you. The journey you are taking is not easy. We all must learn to lean on each other for support along the way. Being loyal is something that you will need that will come in handy on this trail. This says you need to earn loyalty of your fellow scouts in your trip and control. The only way to earn loyalty is you will find that loyalty is best earned by sharing this trail with your fellow scouts, learning them through challenges and times. The scout is helpful. There are many who have helped you along the way thus far. Many of those who have been helpful are here with you today. We invite you to look around this room and say thank you to your Cub Scout leaders, your parents, your friends, and your fellow scouts that have been able to help you. The best way to retain them for their helpfulness is to promise to be helpful to others, a helping hand can shorten these along the trails. As you leave the Cub Scout program, you will have the opportunity to join the Scout BSA troop and meet and meet a lot of new people. We trust they will be friendly and welcome you into the troop. A scout is a friend to all, especially to a fellow scout, just a fellow scout, whether from the same troop or from anywhere else in the world. We have already learned a lot in scout. There is so much more to discover. Others who have gone before the older scout so this is what I need to have much to offer you. A scout is courteous to others and shows respect. And there is something to do with from everyone. While on the trail to Eagle, you will learn many skills that can benefit your world. You may even learn a skill that you will use to save someone's life. Learning about first aid or how to rescue a drowning person, or even how to tie a knot in juices without committing yourself to being kind. And to use the skills to make your community, your nation, and your world a better place. Your fellow scouts and scouters have much to teach you on your trail. Your fellow travelers deserve your respect. Scouts must be obedient in order to learn and grow and protect themselves. I'm going over here. You can be able to find it and go over here. This trail is not undertaken lightly. It will come at a cost. And we learn that the scouts expect it to be thrifty, to use their money and resources wisely. Take care of what is given to you. The destination you seek at the end of your journey cannot be bought for any price. The scout must be brave to face the trail to Eagle and all the challenges that lie ahead. Take courage from your fellow scouts and face the unknown in spite, in spite of any doubts or fears. You will probably get a little dirty at times along the trail to Eagle. It's important to keep a picture with your honor intact. Therefore, remember that a scout is clean and not in an action. Your character will find you. We remember that our duty to God as scouts and our and trust that you will remain reverent and secure in the knowledge that no one walks through this trail alone. The Arrow of Light Award represents the fulfillment of your hard work and dedication throughout Cub Scouts. You have worked hard to earn it, and we congratulate you. As a permanent reminder for all that you have learned here in Pac-94, wear your Arrow of Light Award proudly on your Scout PSA uniform. In a few moments, we will invite you to take your first step on the trail to Eagle. This trail will take you through learning new skills of scoutcraft, leadership, and self-discovery. Mark the stages of this journey by earning the scout rank, followed by a tenderfoot, second class, and first class. Once a first class scout, grow as a leader by taking on responsibilities, such as being a patrol leader, quartermaster, or a troop guide. Earn merit badges that will show you the wonder of the natural world. Open your eyes to a future occupation and learn valuable skills you will, you will use for the rest of your life. After you become a first class scout, continue your journey as a star scout, advancing to life scout. As a life scout, your goal will be, full, will be fully in view, to one day again stand with your family and friends, much, how, much like you are today, receiving scouts' highest honors, the coveted rank of Eagle Scout. We now invite you forward, first to bid a fond farewell to your Beatles and Cub Scout leaders, and then make the first step on the Eagle Trail, where we can welcome you to the, scout, to the Scout BSA. With the representatives from the troops, I keep flipping that.
trustworthy, loyal, helpful, friendly, courteous, kind, obedient, cheerful, thrifty, brave, clean, and ready to Please join me in Scout Oak. On my honor, I will do my best to do my duty to God and my country, to obey the Scout Law, to help other people at all times, to keep myself physically strong, mentally awake, and morally strong. One day, in the not too distant future, we hope to see you once again, surrounded by your family and friends, much like you are today, as you earn the title and distinction of becoming an Eagle Scout. On behalf of Troop 94 and Troop 85, the Scouts BSA, and the entire scouting family, we welcome you on the trail to Eagle. Let us congratulate our new Scouts. Thank <laughs> you.